Hello everybody again and today I will discuss about writing instruments and these are one of my favorite uh, writing instruments actually these are the kind of instruments that I love to own except for this one it's a gel pen but it's okay to have one of these sometimes but I particularly uh, favor fountain pen and click pencils uh, if it's about uh, pencils now the reason why I prefer these is because first of all um, they last for decades uh, I use uh, whenever I buy a fountain pen and if I take good care of it I am likely to um, have it for years like even more than 10 years so that's why I said decade um, so you can uh, just refill them and then use them again now I'll show you the parts of a fountain pen here I have dismantled my fountain pen and um, it had some ink in it and now I have it on my fingers but um, well you got the idea a fountain pen uh, usually has three parts in it um, the body that consists of this barrel um, this part in which the feed and the nib sits together and a cap these are the vital parts of a fountain pen if these break you cannot do anything about it so you have to be very careful about when handling the feed and the nib the nib comes in different sizes and shapes I prefer the round nib this one is not round it has a different kind of pattern that I will show you in some other video when I'm discussing the tips of the nibs of a fountain pen so one mechanism of a fountain pen is this uh, there is a standard universal uh, size of the cartridges you know you can just push them and sorry pull them out and wait a minute like that it, it comes out like this and this hole uh, is it's universal and I prefer you uh, the pens that come with uh, the kind of feed that can take uh, universal size cartridges uh, this cartridge comes in different sizes in the matter of length it can be longer than this and as short as this so what you do is you just uh, put it in and just sort of press it like that and what happens is that the bottom of this feed get immersed into the ink and through the capillary action it comes up against the gravity and fills in to uh, up to here from the back and the nib of the pen will then uh, the ink will flow through this point and then uh, be on the paper and that is how uh, the fountain pen works <clears throat> these are the modern fountain pens earlier uh, sometimes uh, they used to be fountain pens of this kind and uh, it comes with this uh, suction sort of bag you basically the filling mechanism of this kind of fountain pen is that you put it inside an ink bottle and then push it uh, squeeze this bag like that and it will form a vacuum and uh, there will be a suction of ink inside when you do it a few times you know it can fill uh, up and then you can use the this kind of fountain pen um, for some reason I'm never able to fill it 
completely so I find these the most effective um, uh, and most convenient kind of uh, uh, filling mechanisms uh, in the matter of fountain pens because um, these are available in the market just like that and you have to just push it with some force inside of the feed and what happens is that there is a seal on the top of it that breaks and it develops a vacuum in there and it holds up however when uh, this refill or the refill cartridge uh, is empty you can simply just uh, use one of these kind of generic syringes put into the bottle fill them up like that and with the help of the needle you know you can just fill the cartridge just like that yes I've got like a lot of fountain pens this is my fountain pen box and I have many different designs one of them even has a diamond on it that's a real one and these are the Hello Kitty designs uh, my most favorite kind of fountain pens are from Montex and these are Montex fountain pen Montex is an Indian brand so that's it about the fountain pens and their mechanism this was about the this is a general video where I'm discussing about uh, how fountain pens work and the mechanism and the parts of fountain pens in the next video I will discuss why I find uh, fountain pens better than ball pens or your um, gel pens or otherwise ink pens. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel. Like, give me a thumbs up if you liked this video and comment in the comment section below. Bye. Thank you for watching again.